What's up guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel. So I am here with a guy you may recognize, uh, Yoshi Sidarso, the blue Dino Charge Ranger, What's amongst up, a million things, Buffalo <laughs> Boys, and uh, what else have you been doing these days? Just been doing my thing and, and then uh, doing this park thing. What, so what is this park thing? You All like right. help train people, like why, who, what? Basically we do this park thing uh, whenever I'm free, really. Uh, it started about a year and a half ago or something like that. I, was training with a couple people and they were teaching me things uh, for free and, and on their own time. Mm. And one of the things that they said was, uh, we're doing this for you, why are you not going out there and doing this for other people? And I was like... Pay it forward, essentially. Right, basically. Yeah, yeah. And, and um, there's just been a, a shift in the Asian community uh, of actors uh, as of recent. Um, I, I would say in the past few years, where we've kind of gotten uh, together more in a community um, sense mm -hmm. instead of being so like wanting to be the only Asian in a certain production or whatever it was. Each other yeah, more exactly. So and one of the things that we had is, is Cape and uh, Gold House and all these other, uh, I guess, companies doing it. And they were doing stuff in their own right in the sense of like uh, some of them, they would have writers uh, retreats and mm -hmm. this and that. And I realized that I had something that I could give back with, yeah. which was uh, the screen fighting aspect of things. Your so cinema food? Like my you... cinema food, my, my, <laughs> my YouTube food, food yeah, my, you, you know, bullshit food. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> beat that out. But basically, I just wanted to do something where I can have a community of people. It, it, it's not uh, closed off to Asian people, obviously. You're not hey, Asian. Nope. I mean, he might be Indian. He, I he refuses like, to believe that. I have a couple. Of anyway, anyway. <laughs> it's for everybody, and it's kind of just uh, for a lot of my friends who don't know how to do screen fighting. So we are friends. We, uh, you know. Okay, we're getting there. Getting there. Getting there. Okay. We're working on it, okay? We're still building that relationship. True. I don't. True. I wouldn't say friends, really. Acquaintances. Acquaintances is okay. probably the better term. There you go. Yeah. <laughs> but, I mean, I think it's just nice uh, for us also to get to, a chance to hang out, and it's a lot of people get to meet new people and build that community, and... What I don't tell them is, after we train, we end up talking to each other. No, but really, it's like, it's like catching up and, 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 and sometimes in Hollywood, it's kind of like a, a, a weird thing where it's hard to just hang out with people and talk. Yeah. So, unless we're doing something productive first. So it's a productivity then, leading into hanging yeah, out and you feel yeah, okay because like, yeah, I'm not working, we're but I'm also self. doing it. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Well, let's, uh, let's get to it. Yeah, let's do this. All right. So I've done some of these classes with Yoshi before and he usually leads us through a warm up, but just in general for you guys to know, I like to do dynamic stretches and warm ups at the beginning of a workout and then I deep stretch or static stretch at the end. Like a static stretch would be like, all right, I'm gonna hold this for like 30 seconds to a minute, which isn't bad in of itself. It can kind of lose some of the power in your muscles, the tensile strength, so the force they can exert actually decreases if you overstretch too long beforehand. Dynamic warm ups is more like you literally just move dynamically through different positions that you'll probably go through in your workout. So for this, we're gonna throw punches and kicks. So maybe instead of just starting with punches, I'll start with a motion that's similar to how my body will move through the punches. So just easy twisting side to side, just so I don't hurt myself in my obliques and my lower back. And I'm rotating through my knees and through my toes. Um, you know, he'll probably have us do some kicks so instead of going full force immediately. Maybe I'll just swing my leg if I had a bar, or if you have a bar, you can hold it while you kind of move your body through the motions. Um, just so you get that full range and you need to know if you need to hold it a little bit longer and do it a little bit more. Um, so you don't need to be fully 100% like splits before you work on this. You really need to just make sure you're limber enough for whatever your exercise or activity requires of you. So if you're a gymnast and you need your splits, for instance, for your workout, then sure, they may actually do static stretching before because for them it's required to do their activity. Yeah, so this is like dodgeball in elementary school when everyone picks their team and you're last and there's an odd number of people. So right now I'm gonna fight myself. You're doing this and doing a whole other motion and you're going into it. Either you go low here or we go here. Okay, I'll do that. Yes. So we drop, when we drop that knee, Make sure you find that foot and you're going for that foot. Yes, sir. So that way it's not like contrived like that. Hi. We go here, hop. Got it. Hop. Right? And then what's the block here? That. This block. The block is out here. Yeah. Uh, is it tight or low? Far. Yeah. So let's go far. Go for this right here. Yes, sir. Right? Yes, sir. 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 Y
So we have basically come to the end of today's training session with Yoshi. I don't even know the name of his class. I don't even know if he has a name. Superhero training session, I think is actually what it was at one time in like a text message. So yes, we have come to the end of superhero training session. Uh, we actually had three Power Rangers here. So we spent, you know, about an hour and a half working on the basics and then building upon them and then put together like an eight beat choreo. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sound off in the comments below what other kind of fitness ventures you'd like to see and uh, we'll go do them.